Now, when the Muslims who are Sunnis destroy the Muslims who are Shiites, they're also going to kill the Christians in Syria. When they kill the Christians in Syria, they're going to kill the Christians in Lebanon and in Iraq. They're going to kill the Shiites in Lebanon and in Syria. So the good news is, Iran loses two allies, Lebanon and Syria. These countries get overrun by the fanatic Sunni Muslim Brotherhood. And what's going to happen? The Christians, where are they going to go? They're going to come here. Is it good for America or bad for America? It's good for America. But when the Christians leave the Middle East and you're left with Muslim regimes, the regimes collapse. When the Muslim regimes collapse, where do the Muslims go? They come here too. So you're going to have 70 million Egyptian Muslims coming here. You're going to have 10 or 15 million Syrian Muslims coming here, together with the Christians. You're going to have 100 million, Muslim, uh, 100 million immigrants coming here with the Christians. Now, when the Middle East in, in its entirety collapses, because that's what we see happening, the Islamic regime is like communism. It doesn't work. And so the people are going to leave. They're going to come here. Your, your, your population is going to grow to 100, 150 million Muslims. And anyone who protests, like Avi Lipkin, goes to jail. Do you understand why it's so important that America be a Christian country and not a Muslim country? Because when America becomes a Muslim country, it too will self-destruct. Because Islam is a satanic system. Okay.